In mathematics, a Lissajous curve, l u, also known as Lissajous figure or Bowditch curve, bar dt, is the graph of a system of parametric equations which describe complex harmonic motion. This family of curves was investigated by Nathaniel Bowditch in 1815, and later in more detail by Jules Antoine Lissajous in 1857. The appearance of the figure is highly sensitive to the ratio a, b. For a ratio of 1, the figure is an ellipse, with special cases including circles and lines. Another simple Lissajous figure is the parabola. Other ratios produce more complicated curves, which are closed only if a, b is rational. The visual form of these curves is often suggestive of a three-dimensional knot, and indeed many kinds of knots, including those known as Lissajous knots, project to the plane as Lissajous figures. Visually, the ratio a, b determines the number of lobes of the figure. For example, a ratio of 3 over 1 or 1 third produces a figure with three major lobes. Similarly, a ratio of 5 quarters produces a figure with five horizontal lobes and four vertical lobes. Rational ratios produce closed or still figures, while irrational ratios produce figures that appear to rotate. The ratio a, b determines the relative width to height ratio of the curve. For example, a ratio of 2 over 1 produces a figure that is twice as wide as it is high. Finally, the value of delta determines the apparent rotation angle of the figure, viewed as if it were actually a three-dimensional curve. For example, delta equals 0 produces x and y components that are exactly in phase. So the resulting figure appears as an apparent three-dimensional figure viewed from straight on. In contrast, any non-zero delta produces a figure that appears to be rotated, either as a left, right or an up-down rotation. Lissajous figures where A equals 1, B equals N and A Chebyshev polynomials of the first kind of degree N. This property is exploited to produce a set of points, called Padua points at which a function may be sampled in order to compute either a bivariate interpolation or quadrature of the function over the domain, minus 1, 1, times, minus 1, 1. Examples. The animation shows the curve adaptation with continuously increasing fraction from 0 to 1 in steps of 0 0.01. Below are examples of Lissajous figures with delta equals pi 2, an odd natural number a, an even natural number b, and a minus b equals 1, a equals 1, b equals 2, a equals 3, b equals 2, a equals 3, b equals 4, a equals 5, b equals 4. Generation Prior to modern electronic equipment, Lissajous curves could be generated mechanically by means of a harmonograph. Practical application Lissajous curves can also be generated using an oscilloscope. An octopus circuit can be used to demonstrate the waveform images on an oscilloscope. Two phase shifted sinusoid inputs are applied to the oscilloscope in XY mode, and the phase relationship between the signals is presented as a Lissajous figure. In the professional audio world, this method is used for real time analysis of the phase relationship between the left and right channels of a stereo audio signal. On larger, more sophisticated audio mixing consoles, an oscilloscope may be built in for this purpose. On an oscilloscope, we suppose X is CH1 and Y is CH2, A is amplitude of CH1 and B is amplitude of CH2, A is frequency of CH1 and B is frequency of CH2, so A, B is a ratio of frequency of two channels. Finally, delta is the phase shift of CH1, a purely mechanical application of a Lissajous curve with her equals 1. B equals 2 is in the driving mechanism of the Mars-like type of oscillating beam lamps popular with railroads in the mid-1900s. The beam in some versions traces out a lopsided figure 8 pattern with the 8 lying on its side. Application for the case of A equals B. When the input to an LTI system is sinusoidal, the output is sinusoidal with the same frequency, but it may have a different amplitude and some phase shift. 
using an oscilloscope that can plot one signal against another to plot the output of an LTI system against the input to the LTI system produces an ellipse that is a Lissajou figure for the special case of R equals B. The aspect ratio of the resulting ellipse is a function of the phase shift between the input and output with an aspect ratio of 1 corresponding to a phase shift of an an aspect ratio of corresponding to a phase shift of 0 or 180 degrees. The figure below summarizes how the Lissajous figure changes over different phase shifts. The phase shifts are all negative so that delay semantics can be used with a causal LTI system. The arrows show the direction of rotation of the Lissajou figure. In engineering, a Lissajou curve is used in experimental tests to determine if a device may be properly categorized as a memristor. In culture, in film Lissajou figures were sometimes displayed on oscilloscopes meant to simulate high-tech equipment in science fiction TV shows and movies in the 1960s and 1970s. The title sequence by John Whitney for Alfred Hitchcock's 1958 film Vertigo is based on Lissajou figures. Company logos Lissajou figures are sometimes used in graphic design as logos. Examples include, the Australian Broadcasting Corporation, the Lincoln Laboratory at MIT, the University of Electrocommunications, Japan. In modern art the Dadaist artist Max Ernst painted Lissajou figures directly by swinging a punctured bucket of paint over a canvas.